Hey guys, welcome to your uh, love reading for Gemini. This is going to be for your May 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. We are going to take a look at the person that you are thinking of, dealing with. We're going to see what this person has on their mind when it comes to you. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your unique situations. You may switch girls if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave those behind. If this message didn't resonate, with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective um, Gemini people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. I'm going to go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the link for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. So tell me about Gemini. Gemini, the person that Gemini is dealing with is thinking of. What's on this person's mind? When it comes to Gemini, for May 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Gemini. You could apply this to new love, you know, or current love, or an ex, okay? Okay, so we have the Eight of Swords. Okay, Eight of Swords. Nine of Swords, wow. Um, the energy when it comes to this person, the way that they think about you, it's quite heavy here. You know, there's fear, there's worry, this person's stressed, this person's anxious, uh, this person's losing sleep over you. Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. So they could have done something wrong here in that this person could be coming in with an apology here. Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Seems like you guys are about to have some sort of conversation here to resolve things here, okay? Both Earth energies, perhaps you guys, you could be dealing with an Earth sign here. You could have Earth energy in your chart here, Gemini, with the Three of Wands. King of Swords, yeah. Someone here is ready to talk. Someone here wants to apologize. Someone here wants to move forward and resolve things here with you, Sagittarius. Whatever, not Sagittarius, Gemini, whatever happened... Between you and your person, they're ready to apologize, resolve things, and move on, okay? Could be dealing with the Sagittarius here. Tell me the uh, Eight of Swords in the Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Why am I reading out the... This is Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Uh, the Nine of Swords and the Empress here, Libra, Taurus, Energy. Some here is coming with an apology. I feel like this person doesn't want to lose you here. Okay, this person sees a potential for growth and expansion here with you. You know, I feel like this person wants to manifest here with you. But it could be a situation that you are resisting this person. You are blocking this person out because I feel like you've been really hurt by this individual here. Three of Swords. Yeah, it seems like they want to clear the air. They want to resolve things. If there's a third party that got in the way here. Okay, yeah, because I feel like there is a situation where I feel like there are other people involved here. And if you guys are separated, they're looking to reconcile here with you, okay? Judgment, Sagittarius, energy. And they're looking to tell you the truth here, okay? If they haven't really told you the truth or that things haven't really been clear between you and your person here. What else do we have here for Gemini? What else does Gemini need to know, look out for, work on for May 2024? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Gemini. We have the High Priestess, Cancer, Pisces, Energy. The Hierophant, Taurus, Energy. Nine of Wands. Ace of Cups. The Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy. I do feel like this person knows that they have hurt you here. And I feel like this person is definitely sort of like learning and wising up from the experience that they had here with you. Okay? And I feel like they're trying to make, make things right here with you. The 
only problem is, is that my concern is that this person's coming in as, as a page here, page of wands. This is an individual that's not very serious about a relationship. This is an individual that is, you know, kind of like, you know, they rather prefer friends with benefits than anything serious here. So if this person showed you that, that they weren't serious before, it could be a possibility that they're showing you that they're not serious again if you move forward with this individual here. Okay, so uh, tell me about the High Priestess. The death card, Scorpio energy. Why is the Hierophant here? Four swords. You know, Gemini, I feel like you're completely disengaging from this person. You know, for you, once it's over, it's over. There's no going back. You're done with this person. Yeah, I actually don't see... It, 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 if there's separation here, I don't see you guys getting back together with this person here. I mean, you guys could also be moving towards new love here too. Yeah, you guys could also be moving towards new love here. And this person can't stand it or that this person's really jealous here. Yeah, they're really jealous of the person that you're moving towards or that the person that you're with in this current moment. Nine of Wands. Why is the Nine of Wands here? The Nine of Wands. Seven of Cups. Here's the thing. I feel like this person is someone here who's quite confused. You know, I feel like they don't even know why they did the they, they don't even know why they did the things that they did here. So if you're looking for a clear answer, I feel like this person is unable to explain it or just can't articulate it well or that they just can't give it to you. Yeah, the Ace of Cups here. If this person went towards other options here, this person wants to be with you now, okay? The Ace of Cups here and the Fool. Aries energy, Aquarius energy. Yeah, this person just wants to be with you. They're like, let's do this. Let's make things happen here, okay? Uh, the thing, my, my only concern is that this person's not really truly committal though. Yeah, I just feel like they're saying all these things because they don't want to lose you, okay? But I feel like this person, in terms of executing this, making this happen, I just don't see this person doing it. And I feel like you've given this person many chances, you know, and I feel like by the second or third ch chance that, you know, if this person does, hasn't shown you that they've, are changing, more than likely that, that this person is not going to change. We have the uh, Page of Wands here and the Three of Pentacles here. So they want to work things out here with you. But you're distancing yourself from this person. You're focusing on yourself. You're focusing on doing inner work here, focusing on healing here. So I feel like in terms of Coming back to the, together with this person that is not in the cards for you here, uh, Gemini, okay? So Gemini, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.